Hello friends, welcome to my channel. So my name is Pramod Thorath and this is another Komsha A plus core exam practice test series part 8. So this practice test series is very helpful to pass the Komsha A plus core exam. So before you get start, don't forget to subscribe to the channel to see more video like this. So let's begin. Number 1. An organization maintains various record types including health and criminal justice records so which of the following cloud environments is the organization most likely to use to limit the attack surface so option a is public option b is hybrid option c is community option d is private and the correct answer is option a public so let's move to the next question question number two so which of the following describes metered utilization of cloud resources so option one is resources provision instantly option b is payments made only for resources that are used option c is resources put in increased computing power option d is implementation of rapid elasticity and the correct answer is b payments made only for resources that are used so question number three a technician is receiving reports that the entire office sporadically losses network connectivity throughout the day so the technician determines the root cause to be emi which of the following cable mediums would be the most cost effective without sacrificing system performance so option a is coaxial option b is shielded cat6 cable option c is plenum cat5 cable option d is multimode fiber and the correct answer is c plenum cat5 cable so let's move to the next question question number four a colleague has a laptop that has been working as expected for several years but the laptop now has a small bug in the bottom casing sorry bottom casing and over its occasionally white plug into wall outlet so the most likely component that needs to be replaced is the and your option a power adapter option b is a battery option c system pan option d is hard drive the correct option is battery so battery needs to be replaced for this condition so these all questions are helpful to pass the core one exam so let's move to the next question question number five a company just bought a printer capable of automatically printing on both sides of the paper after installations however the technicians can only print on both sides of the papers so manually so which of the following should be the technician do to fix the issue so option a is install the most recent firmware upgrade b contract the vendor for a hardware replacement c install the printer software and drives and d read the installation manual and configure duplex settings so correct option is d read the installation manual and configure the duplex setting we need to change the duplex settings on printer so let's move to the next question question number six a small office has a wireless network with several access points for roaming laptop use. So user occasionally reports that the wireless connection drops or becomes very slow. Users have confirmed that this issue only happens when connected to the office wireless networks. So which of the following goes likely to the cause? A is hidden SSID, B is device interference, option C is Ethernet port flapping and option D is high ISP latency. So the correct answer is B device interference so let's move to the next question question number seven so which of the following cloud models maintains access even when a local internet outage occurs so a option is private option B is SaaS option C is community option D is public and the correct answer is a private so private cloud models which maintain access 
So let's move to the next question, question number 8. A user is researching hard drives to upgrade a PC and has decided to purchase a NVMe drive. So which of the following should the user confirms are available on the PC before making the purchase? Choose two. We need to choose two options. One is A is SATA, B is M.2, C is PCI card, D is SAS, E is SCSI and F is DRAM. The correct answer is P, M.2 and C, PCI. So let's move to the next question, question number 9. A laptop has been returned for a screen repair. So the owner insists the screen is broken, but occasionally a faded image is able to be seen in very bright settings on the desktop. So which of the following steps should the repair technician take first? Option A, replace the graphics card. Option B, replace the screen as the customer insists. Option C, recommend the usage of an external display instead. Option D, ensure the backlight lights. Function is accepted. And this is the correct answer. Option D is ensure the backlight is functioning as accepted. So let's move to the last question for this part 7 series. So core 1 uh, exam test series. So let's move to the last question, question number 10. A laptop PC user is reporting issues with the hard drive. A file system check shows that all files are accessible and the file system is clean. So after the check, the PC still issues a hard drive error message. So which of the following is the most likely cause of the error? Option A is a smart failure. Option B is a IOPS failure. Option C is a DIM failure. Option D is a RAM failure. Sorry, RAID failure. And the correct answer is C, DIM failure. So that's it for this uh, part 7 uh, core 1 exam test series. So if you want more video like this, please subscribe this channel. Thanks for watching. Thank you.